I recently preached my first sermon ever, and I will start out this video with one of the Bible verses I used. It comes from Joshua chapter 1, verse 9. It says to be strong and courageous, do not be afraid, do not be discouraged, because the Lord your God will go with you wherever you go. So that's what I wanted to share today. Keep that in mind and stay positive out there, fellas. But I got a lot of mail. Uh, I also want to give you an update on my contest so far uh, but and a trade, a YouTube trade, which will be a lot of fun. Uh, so just want to show off a few things, give you the update, and then we'll get out of here. All right. So all my stuff is behind me sitting up on the big unit so that I can uh, show it off and then put it away. So let, let's grab this stuff. Thanks. First up, to complete a 2021 goal for me, I wanted to add five new Hall of Fame bobbleheads, get to a total of 25. I have, here's my new Barry Larkin bobblehead, and my new Joe Morgan bobblehead. Got both of them for a total of 30 shipped, which is a great deal considering uh, I try and get them for 20 or less when I can, and shipping just kills you online for bobbleheads, but those are my two newest Hall of Fame bobbleheads, and uh, that completes a 2021 collecting goal. Sweet. So those are down. This card is not a new Hall of Fame autograph to my collection, but it helped me make the trade that I'm going to talk about here in just a second. Uh, but this is a new Perez Steel Hall of Fame postcard for my collection. I'm right around 30 of these now, 30 different ones. So Rick Farrell, Hall of Famer. Uh, I traded away my uh, greatest moments Perez Steel because I like the Hall of Fame postcards better. So that's what I did. That helped me make my trade. Now, for the trade. You could probably see what the item is when I turn around and got it, but you don't know who it is yet. Uh, first, I want to shout out Kevin. Uh, he is SciGuy29 here on YouTube. Uh, he has just over 100 subscribers when I checked recently right before this video. But I love his content. He likes Hall of Fame stuff. He likes vintage. He likes his twins. He's in Iowa, uh, collects a lot of Iowa baseball-related stuff too, uh, some Royal stuff as well. Uh, he has a personal relationship with a former Royals player. Go check it out to find out which one. Uh, you may remember him if you're a fan of the 80s or the 90s. But anyways, I watched his baseball room tour video, which was done before my contest. Uh, but I noticed an item, a baseball that you guys saw, that he had two of. So I reached out to him and said, hey man, I would love to trade for one of those if you, know, you don't want to keep both of them. And he said, oh yeah, let, let's talk about it and see what we can do. Uh, he does have his end of the trade up on YouTube now, which I will provide a link to so you can find not just that video, but his channel uh, so that you can subscribe to him. It is a Hall of Famer. It is a pretty big one, uh, especially in terms of modern Hall of Famers, because this player did die at a young age, uh, and so he didn't sign a whole, whole lot, unfortunately, making his autographs a little more expensive, so it is kind of tough but I am thrilled to add this Kirby Puckett autograph baseball to my collection. Pretty sweet, right? Super sick. Uh, this also helped me hit a 2021 goal uh, to add four Hall of Fame autograph baseballs this year. So thrilled to have that. Thank you again, Kevin. Awesome trade. Very happy with my end. I hope you are. I'm going to watch your video soon. Lastly, I'm going to do an update on my contest so far. If you haven't done it yet, maybe you need a little encouragement. Maybe you want to see what some of the prizes are. The deadline is the 28th of August, so let's go back over what the rules are, and let's check out some of the prizes you could get. All right, so again, reminder what you have to do on my contest do a video response uh, outlining your card room. Uh, if you don't have a card room, you can talk about what you'd like to have in one someday. I will also accept that as a response. And comment on my original video 
and tell me what your favorite part of my baseball room is. So far for entrance in the contest, we have Lou Rock TV, Caught Looking with Mike Armstrong, Papino Man, Reindeer Studios, Mr. Fisher Bike, G's Mikey, and Sticks and Seams. So seven of those guys, and I've got three prizes. So right now, your odds are great. So shoot a video. Here are the three things we've got. Number one, a factory sealed set of 2003 tops, complete set. Then next up, it is in low grade, but a 1972 tops, Willie Mays. And finally, because I think I'm going to fall just short of getting to 500 subs uh, by the end of my contest, it reminded me of this player. And since I've got a few autographs of them, I decided I'll give this one away. Uh, and that is going to be none other than a uh, Fred McGriff autograph because he had 493 home runs. And it's a crime, dog, that he didn't get to 500 dingers. So those are my three prizes. Uh, I'll probably draw out three names. And the first winner will get to select first. The second winner, second, and a third winner will get the remaining item. All right, guys. Keep collecting. God bless. Go enter my contest.